pull up a beach chair and layer on the sunscreen. We are kicking off the summer with more product updates to give you more flexibility in Airtable. It's time for what's new in two. What's new in two? Do you pull regular reports to send to executives or ahead of your team meeting? Document Automator lets you speed up the process while keeping everyone on the same page. This latest automation lets you automatically export your data into Google Docs, set a time-based trigger, and create a quick sprint update or campaign report while you focus on other work. Next up are some customizations so you can format sync tables however you want. When configuring a sync, you can now use the advanced drop-down option to change your primary field. And after creating your sync table, you can also change up all of your additional field types so you can easily tailor your data to your unique workflow. Do you need to close form submissions temporarily? All you have to do is click Stop Accepting New Responses to disable submissions. Your share link will remain active the whole time. Simply turn the toggle off when you're ready to reopen your form. Our final update is an announcement. Apps are now going to be called extensions. Don't worry, you're not losing any functionality. The name change is a part of our larger vision to extend Airtable and your workflow even more. And we've reached the sunset on June's product update roundup. Make sure to give us a like and subscribe and we'll see you next month.